I am literally trembling because outside the store is the Neil deGrasse Tyson. Damn! Hold me back. Believe it or not, he has agreed to come in and sit down with me and talk about space, and I'm losing my mind. I'm so excited and I'm so nervous. Let's do it. <laughs> Welcome to the universe. Hello everybody, I am Aliza Kelly. I am the astrologer here at the Drew Barrymore Show and I am here with my new friend, Neil deGrasse Tyson, who, does not, who is not an astrologer. That, that is a, a very true fact. <laughs> Why not? Question number one. Sure. Did anyone ever think that what you do is the work of an astrologer? Was ever someone like, oh. In, in the old days when you would just say, oh, I'm an astronomer, they'll say, oh, tell me my star sign or this sort of thing. And then, but when you say astrophysicist, that yeah, takes yeah, care yeah, of that. right. No, I, I don't have that. Nobody confuses that. <laughs> <at laughs> yeah, this I don't point. have that title. I try to take charge of your own destiny, which is harder to do if you're always looking up, thinking that the universe is controlling you. Well, I don't think that the universe controls us. I think that what we see is a beautiful projection of self, and we have these incredible archetypes that allow us to see ourselves as these multidimensional people, as the universe and the cosmos Isn't, are multidimensional. Wasn't the Greek and Roman religions, which we today call mythologies, wasn't that exactly this? Yes. Think about it. Yeah. There was a god of this, and, and, and the gods were not perfect. They get angry sometimes, and they get, they get jealous, they get think. And so everything that we care about being human was manifest in these external forces. It gave them a, a pathway to make sense out of things that didn't otherwise make sense in their life. There's just Poseidon who got angry with me. That's why I threw some waves on my shoulder. <laughs> so I'm I'm in complete agreement with you. We we believe it or not, we align. On oh. this. <laughs> in a planetary way, <laughs> do we do. align? We do. Well, do you know that you're a Sagittarius rising? Be honest. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I well, for our viewers at home, um, can I tell you what Sagittarius wait, 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 is? In a moment, uh, before we sat down, you asked me what my star sign was. Correct. I think you did. And I, my response, well, of course, it's very public because I'm a public figure. But if you didn't otherwise know and you were an astrologer, why should I have to tell you? You should just know. Oh, okay? no, 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 no. That's not how it works. Why not? I'm not a psychic. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> the other people are the psychics. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so I'm, I'm born in October. I know you're a Libra. I'm born in October. <laughs> mm -hmm. October what? Fifth. Uh, I know you're a Libra, mm -hmm. but I also know you're a Sagittarius rising, or at least mm -hmm. I think. There's some birth info that's out there for you. It might not be accurate, but you really strike me as a Sagittarius rising. Okay. Can but, I tell you a little bit? But that wouldn't be the case if you didn't <laughs> otherwise know that I was born in October because Sagittarius no, is adjacent to that, so. Well, the yeah. rising sign is actually which zodiacs, which zodiac sign, not constellation, which zodiac sign was coming up from the Eastern horizon at your exact moment of birth. Mm. So it's another piece of the puzzle. Mm. Because in astrology, we have all different zodiac signs with the planets. Well, that's part of the challenge is because you have so many forces operating on the conclusions that you draw. It's up to you, the interpreter, to that's mix and match to find something that might be relevant or feel important to the, on the receiving end totally. of, that, of that commentary. So for that reason, I have much less confidence in it than you do because it's given that level of interpretation, uh, will five different astrologers give you that same answer? Probably not. No, because I'm the best. What? <laughs> 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 I think his Sag rising really saw my Leo sun. Welcome to the universe.